Hey, Caesar, the Yay leaving San Piero, right? Right, but they're using bikes, CJ, and they go cross country. Okay, I'm gonna see what I can dig up. No, I never left this place. Why should I? Get off the road if you're not gonna try! <laughs> Little miniature idiots that look like you! Move out of the desert, you moron! I guess you're right. Well, thanks, Maurice. I am right, and I'm Maurice on Gardening with Maurice. Gardening with Maurice, only on WCTR. The news, and all the other things that really matter to you, like people dying. A lady on fire. Bodies everywhere. And explosions. She is hanging from the tree. This accident is really cool. WCTR. Let's go find out what's really happening in the world. News. I'm Leanne Forger, WCTR News. We distort and you can't retort. Breaking news. Is skateboarding turning your son gay? Also, San Fierro has been hit by one tenth scale chaos recently following a series of many terrorist attacks. Tiny techno terrorists are suspected. More on that story as it comes in. A district attorney is facing a long jail sentence after he was arrested outside the Bankoff Hotel trying to escape with well over a ton of marijuana. Police are currently investigating claims it was for personal use. Staying with pot. Police are celebrating the destruction of a major hall of marijuana in Flint County recently. Unfortunately, the huge fire caused problems for local wildlife, much of which was found eating chocolate, listening to the same band over and over, and buying fractal artwork. Richard Burns is on the scene. I am wicked, baby. Hey, man, you got shot, but you look great, baby. Hey, who's the guy with the antlers? Oh, shit! No, dude! Dude, I was just checking to see if she was in heat. No, it's cool, dude! She's your go! Dude, be cool! <clears throat> All right. Inhabitants of Bone County reported further inexplicable lights over the desert. Yeah, sure did. Government officials blamed the water supply. And more positive news came from street good guy Big Smoke, who today unveiled his new orphanage in a ceremony in Los Santos. Yes, thank you, thank you. I'd just like to say this is a great day for the impoverished disadvantage of Los Santos. And it's a real honor that I am as generous as I am. I remember when I was a little boy, my dear mother would ask me what I wanted to be when I grew up. And I said, Mom, I want to be a saint. It's a great opportunity. The Big Smoke Orphanage teaches kids important skills. I was an orphan. I struggled. I saw friends make mistakes and get pulled from the path of righteousness. But now, thanks to the generosity of a great man like me, kids is going to be safe. Big Smoke, baby! Remember the name! gang trouble in San Fierro is on the rise, with problems developing between Chinese triad gangs and Vietnamese gangs. A government official released this statement. Hey, if they want to kill each other, let them. It's great. It means your taxes go down. I'm Leanne Forger, WCTR News. Stay indoors. All the news the government wants you to hear. WCTR. It's time for chicken. Cock a doodle doo, it's time for a feast. Eat a nine piece, but you two can tell. He's been to Clucking Bell. The chicken is a bird with a tiny brain. So we assume he doesn't feel any pain. We shrink their heads and we breed them fast. Six wings, forty breast, and their guys. Cock a doodle doo, we're psychotic. Cock a doodle do, factory farming's insane. We denied it all before our stock price fell. Come down to the Lucking Bell. Clucking Bell! If you enjoy it, the chicken didn't die in vain. If you're into exploring exotic places and forbidden fruit, stay tuned. It's the Wild Traveler. Next. Hello, I'm James Batiston, World Traveler, and this is the Wild Traveler. From Peru to San Andreas in eight days by the moon, often while lounging around garden parties, we could get the brave workers worldwide who toil day and night for the products we consume. Some are even so dedicated to our happiness they carry products in balloons shoved inside themselves to be a balloon. Mesmerizing. We go to the phones. Yes, we do. 
I can't believe you actually recommended we go to Barbados on our honeymoon. It was revolting. You were poor people. I live in fine to be away from poor people. Barbados is another. Look, well, I want to be very clear. I'm not racist. Just careful. Okay. I like all inclusive resorts where you can drink as much as you want, be around other people from San Andreas, and the only interaction you have with the local is if you need a cocktail or, or some spice in the bedroom with your husband. Well, that sounds lovely. With people like you, it's no wonder we don't bother curing cancer. Next caller, you're on the Wild Traveler. Roar! Yeah, it's funny. You go on and on about other countries, but you live here. America rules you, Tommy. Eat me. Well, we've been trying. Tom, you're on the line. I am so sick of England. Who does go to the pub? Me. They're all alcohol. At least we drink a 24 pack in private instead of hanging out in some social setting making a fool of ourselves. People say it's so civilized in Europe. They got thousands of years of history. Well, I saw a movie about Europe once and I was disgusted. And people still defecate in their living rooms and cover it up with dirt like a cat. You can't find a decent starlet anywhere. Or a good chicken wing. And the strippers? <laughs> Overcharge. Good lord, you're innocent. We should you stay out of England. You I hear there is a casino in Ventura's that is just like the rest of the world, only with better toilets and full of morons like you. Do you oh, want God. culture? Do you want safe? Please! Hello, you're on Wild Traveler. Where are you? 